Welcome, 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 Jesus. We love you. We worship you. We honor you. We glorify your name. You are worthy. You are a wonderful king of glory. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. We welcome you in the name of Jesus. We welcome your presence, God, in the name of Jesus. I welcome you, Holy Spirit, move. Holy Spirit, move. Holy Spirit, move. Move, move. Touch us, Lord. Touch our life. Touch the life of your people, my Father. In the name of Jesus, I bleed the blood of Jesus over your people. In the mighty name of Jesus, I cover you with the blood of Jesus. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Thank you, newcomers. This is Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry. Welcome you to, to join us at uh, Periscope. We, we always uh, in the Periscope Saturday, 8 o'clock a.m. and Sunday, 8 o'clock a.m. Monday to Thursday, we have midnight, uh, 12 midnight. Uh, you are welcome. We have also prayer line. You can join our prayer line too. I want to welcome you so much. Thank you for coming. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Isigi. Welcome you. Oh, welcome to Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry. Once again, Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry invites you, invite you to receive your deliverance of salvation, breakthrough, deliverance from bad dreams, marital problem, business failure, evil, evil family pattern, poverty, witchcraft, and any form of attacks. Welcome once again. Today I'm going to talk to you the subject called Deliverance Prayer for Opening Gates and Doors. And this, 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 this topic is, is, is more pro prophecy. I'm going to prophesy to you. It is a prophetic uh, uh, um, uh, topic. And it is one I'm going to speak a lot of uh, prophecy over your life in the mighty name of Jesus. So, uh, before I go far, I want to give you opportunity to, ca to call me after this prayer. Then I can prophesy to you personally, uh, 101. And the, our number is 647-608-5207. Or you can call me 905 Four eight seven seven one nine six. Call me. I would prophesy one o one personal prophecy. And this one, it's is you can pick from here. If you are the one, as I'm going to speak general, I as the Holy Spirit will lead me. And then if you are the one, then you would say Amen. Praise God. Thank you. Welcome once again. Uh, the topic I'm going to talk to you is called. Deliverance prayer for opening gates and doors. You know there is gates and there is door. There is a gate. There is a gate. You when you go, there is a gate you enter. Every country has a gate, and this gate you enter the gate, and then you can enter the door. Without the gate, you can't enter the door. So it is an opening. I'm going to, to pray to, to, to pray that today your gate is going to open. Some of you. Men, some of you, your gates is closed. So I'm going to pray that God will open your gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Some of you, your door are closed behind you and you have no idea. That's why I'm going to, to pray that God will open your, your doors in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, the, the door is going to be open in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let's go to the scripture straight away. From the book of Isaiah 60, verse 11. New American Standard Bible. The book of Isaiah 60, verse 11. From the Bible, New American Standard Bible. The Bible says, Your gates will be open continually. They will, they will not be closed day or night. So that men may bring to you the wealth of nations with their kings lit in possession. In the mighty name of Jesus, I prophesy to you, your gates, your gates will be open. Your gates will be open. You are going to receive money. People are going to bring you money. And nations are going to bring you money. 
I am prophesying to you. I'm speaking prophetically prophecy to you. According to this scripture, your gates will be open. Some of you, your gates has been closed. You have no idea. That's why you are going through very difficult. When your gate is closed, no matter. You can be in America. You can be in Canada. You can be in a wealthy uh, in international countries. But you, you, your gate is closed. When your gate is closed, nothing will, you can't enter. So I am praying that God is going to open the gate. Your gate is going to open. And it is going to open day and night. No time it will be closed. And, the, and, and people will bring you money. Money will come to your life. Wealth will come in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that God is going to open. Your gate is going to open. It has been closed for a long time. It is now your time that the gates will be open. And the people will bring money. Look at that scripture. Your gates will be open continually. They will not be closed day or night. You know, you see there's powers close the door, the closing the door. Close the door. They said there's powers closing the gate that you cannot enter. But the Bible is telling you it is going to be open day and night. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, thank you. It is a, it's, it, when I got this message, I jumped, I, I was very happy that the gates and doors, it is going to open day and night. So men may bring you the wealth of the nations. The wealth of this country will come. The wealth of your country will come. The wealth from far away will come to you in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, I prophesy to you. The, the wealth of this nation, where you are living, it is going to come. Automatically you will receive. Maybe you have been trying to start business, nothing is happening. You are starting a ministry, nothing is happening. But as according to this scripture, I prophesy to you, good news is coming. You will be prosper. You are going to get money. Wealth is going to come and follow you in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's look in another scripture from the book of Jeremiah 33. Verse 11. Jeremiah 33, verse 11. The Bible says, The voice of joy and the voice of gladness, the voice of the bridegroom and the voice of the, the bride, the voice of them that shall say, Praise the Lord of hosts, for the Lord is good, for his must endures forever. And of them that shall bring the sacrifice of praise unto the house of the Lord, for I will cause Return the captivity of the land as the first says the Lord. Amen, amen, amen. The voice, the, your voice is going to be is, is going to be heard as the voice of bridegroom in the mighty name of Jesus. I prophesy to you, your voice is going to be heard like the, the, the voice of the bridegroom in the name of Jesus. I prophesy to you, your voice. Your voice is going to be like the voice of the bridegroom in the mighty name of Jesus. That is prophetic and prophesies. Maybe your voice has not been heard. Maybe your voice has been closed. Closed. Now because the door has opened, so your voice also is open. Many people would hear your voice like the voice of the bridegroom in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Your voice Hallelujah. It's going to be the, like the voice of the bridegroom in the mighty name of Jesus. And it is going to press when you speak the word. It will go direct where it is supposed to go. It is like the voice of the bridegroom. I prophesy your voice to be like the voice of pro, uh, bridegroom in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I bless God. I thank you in the mighty name of Jesus. These are the scriptures I'm giving you to memorize them and claim them in the mighty name of Jesus. The voice of joy, the voice of joy, and the voice of gladness, the voice of the bridegroom, and the voice of the, the, the bride, the voice of, of them that shall say, Praise the Lord of hosts in the mighty in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty the voice of joy. 
Hallelujah. The voice of joy. Your voice, you will be joy. Will be joy like a, a voice of the bridegroom. In the mighty name of Jesus. Your voice will be joy. A joyful voice like the bridegroom. In the mighty name of Jesus. I receive the joy, the, the voice of, of the, the bridegroom in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. I am going to look another scripture from Isaiah 42, verse 9. No more closed gates. Your gate is open. Your doors are open. You will enjoy like the voice of the bridegroom. Your voice will be like the voice of the bridegroom in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's look in the book of, of Isaiah 42, verse 9. Isaiah 42, verse 9. Hello, hello from, from Russia. Isaiah 42, verse 9. King James Bible says, Behold, the former things are come to pass, and the new things do I declare before the spring forth. I tell you of them. Now the whole things has passed away. The month of August has taken everything away. From January to August, all those old things you have been going through, it has been taken away from you in the mighty name of Jesus. I prophesy to you, everything, every battle, anything that has been fattering you, it has been passed away. It has gone in the mighty name of Jesus. It has gone. I declare new things. I declare new things. New things to come to pass in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare new things to come to your life in the mighty name of Jesus. New doors is opening for you. New windows is opening for you. New gates is opening for you. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus, all those bad things that has been happening to you, it has passed. And let new things come to you in the mighty name of Jesus. New things has come to you in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. I prophesy to you, new things is coming. Expect new things in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, yes, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Glory be the name of Jesus. I am going to read from the book of Proverbs. <laughs> yes, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory be the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. I'm going to read from the book of Proverbs 25, verse 25. Yes. Proverbs 25, verse 25, the Bible says from King James, uh, As cold water is to thirst soul, so is good news from a far country. I prophesy to you, good news is coming from far country. Good news is coming. Your, your phone is going to ring with good news because the gates has been opened in the mighty name, name of Jesus. Good news is coming. You will hear good news in the mighty name of Jesus. The phone is coming. You are going to get good letter. You are going to get a letter in your mail. You are going to hear good news. The bank, the, the, the debt has been cancelled. The debt has been cancelled. Good news is coming as we are beginning the new month in the mighty name of Jesus. The good things are coming. Whole things are passed away in the mighty name of Jesus. I thank God for good news. Things is coming. You will hear good news. Good news. Your, your phone is going to ring and bring good news from far. Even some of you who applied the job long time ago, the good news is coming. Those people have been applying the visa working permit those people have been looking for husband wives children good news is coming doctor is going to call to you that you have conceived good news is coming it is a month this month of september is a month of labor it's a month of pushing it's a month of giving good things therefore i pray good things is coming on your way in the mighty name of jesus Glory be the name of Jesus. I thank God. Good things is coming. Good things is coming. You will hear new things in the mighty name of Jesus. I prophesy to you speedily. New things is coming. Good things is coming in the mighty name of Jesus. You will receive good, good news. Some of your ministry that has been small, that has been, uh, that, 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 that has been, uh, has not been doing well. You will receive news. When you go to church, you will be surprised. You will be told, come quickly. There's a lot of people in your ministry. I pray that God Almighty will bring this good news to you. No powers of darkness will stop them in the mighty name of Jesus. I, I, no, pro, no, no powers of darkness will hinder them. If you close, you close any door, 
that 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 if you close any door the almighty god is going to open you that you have had the bible says it is going to open day and night in the mighty name of jesus you are business people with the different vision my sister your vision you are going to receive good news your vision you have your plans you have it has been piling in you you don't know what to do about it good news you are, you are going to receive good news God is going to break you to show you how you do. Somebody is coming to help you, to lead you and, and help you in the mighty name of Jesus. You are going to receive a partner. You are going to receive a partner. Somebody who will help you. You are going to receive spiritual mother, spiritual father who will stand with you in the mighty name of Jesus. New door is opening. New gates is opening. Gates, gates is opening. Tonight, not tonight, tomorrow morning. I am going to talk about this more, about the, the, the gates of heaven that will be open for you. And I'm going to pray for you until I see your heaven is opening in the mighty name of Jesus. Therefore, I thank God that God is able in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that if I close every door, I close every, every, every door that has been opened, opened, opened against your life through evil covenant ceremony and sacrifice in the name of Jesus. I am closing every evil door because God has opened a new door. No evil door that will come and close your doors in the, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I thank you. Yes, I, I praise your name for your life in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus, I am so excited because I've seen the doors uh, gates has been has been open because many of you you have no idea you've been in a country you have been in the states america canada in england australia and your gates has been closed you can't do anything you know when they it is closed you 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 can't enter you are there but everything is closed now good news you will hear the news from far it has been open in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I renounce every covenant agreement made with any evil power that brought them into the gate of your life to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. What, 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 whatever brought evil powers at the gates of your life, I lend them powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. I lend them powerless in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of every demon of gates of your life, I bind them, I destroy them in the name of Jesus. I command them to get out of your life in the name of Jesus. Every, every demon of the gates of your life in the name of Jesus, I cast them, I break them, I destroy them in Jesus' name. When you feel, uh, uh, when you feel spider web covering your face, when you move on a peace, uh, on a peace road, entering through common uses, there are evil cases that, that has been closing your, your, your gates. Therefore, I cut it, I destroy it, I lend them powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord, thank you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. If you get opportunity for jobs, ministry, marriage, childbearing, extra, then great op uh, opposition or stress come, comes upon to resist your progress, to resist your progress, in, in that opening and when you measure that they great that opportunity the strong also opposition different 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 level different devil that indicates that there are demonic gates that you order to dismantle from your life in jesus name you see let me repeat this in the name of jesus you know uh if you get opportunities for jobs ministry marriage, child pair extra, then you get opposition or a straight comes up to resist your progress in that opening. And when you measure that, the great opportunity, the strong also the opposition, different level, different devil, that indicates that there are demonic gates that you order to dismantle from your life. So I pray that every gate, every satanic gate, I dismantle them. I dismantle them. The gates that has been programmed in your life, I dismantle them, I bind them, I let them pack out, I remove them, I uproot them in the mighty name of Jesus. Every gate that is closed, that is closed against you, I am dismantled them. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. I am praying according to the book of Isaiah 60, verse 11, that the, the doors, the gates will be continually open. No demon, no powers from the devil, no evil will close your door in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, thank you, Teresha. <laughs> yes, thank you, thank you so much. I'm going to pray every sign work over demonic gates in your life be dismantled in the name of Jesus. I am going to pray for you right now. Every sign work of demon gates in your life be dismantled in the mighty name of Jesus. All demonic gates responsible for influence in your life be broken down in the mighty name of Jesus. All demonic gates responsible for your influence in your life I break them down in Jesus' name. All demonic gate men in your life, I displace and replace you now with the angels of God in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, all demonic gate man in your life, I displace and replace you now with the angels of the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Dismantle, dismantle, dismantle every evil gates. You don't need them. I, I was surprised when I was when I got this message. Some of you I sent you the message that I got. If I've not sent you a message, call me. Our number is six four seven. Or you can WhatsApp me. Uh, our number is six four seven six zero eight five two zero seven. I want to help you and promise is more to you and speak to you one on one. In the name of Jesus, these gates must be dismantled, must be destroyed from your life. You must move on. You cannot live this life. You cannot be battering all the time, fighting, fighting. It is high time. The Bible has prophesied to you, according to Isaiah 60, verse 11, that the, the doors, the gates is open day and, 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 and night. No demon from the bottomless of beat will close your gates in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes. Our email address is overcomers, d h m at gmail.com. So you can email me if you need prayers. Yes, I am, com I am coming against all demonic gate man in your life. I disgrace and repress you now with the angels of the Lord in Jesus' name. I close every opening of the devil unto your life in the name of Jesus. I close every gate of the devil. Every gate the devil is opening against you. Every gate, every door, every door the devil is opening against you. I close it in Jesus' name. I close that door no more because God has opened the door for you. God has opened the gates for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, I want to thank God for your life. No powers of darkness will, will close down your gates that God has opened. Receive the gates. Receive opening gates of God and doors of heaven in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. No opportunity shall be diverted from you in the name of Jesus. No opportunity shall be diverted from you in the mighty name of Jesus. You know, you are almost to get something. You are expecting you are going to get it. And then that opportunity is taken from you and given to another person. I don't know if you, if you have seen this. You expecting something, you prayed, you trust, you, you, you believe you are going to get it, and then that thing is being diverted, taken to be given to someone else. No, nothing would happen like that. No opportunity shall be diverted from you. No powers of darkness would divert your opportunity, would divert good things that belong to you and be given to another person in the mighty name of Jesus. I cancel it. I lend that them powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. All wicked opposition that rise up against your, your, your opportunities would, would, be, would be put to a shame in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, my God, I want to thank you. All wicked oppositions that rise up against your opportunities would be put to a shame. All those evil personality, wicked, rising up, against your opportunity would be dismantled, would be disgraced, would be put to a shame in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, thank you, Father. You know, when you start a project or a business, there's, op there's, uh, there's oppositions that will rise up to fight you, to bring you down. They will chant and speak against you. 
I, they will be, they will be shamed. They are going to be ashamed in the name of Jesus. I pray any opposition racing up against your ministry, racing up, up against your partner, racing up, they would be ashamed. They would be disgraced and be bring down in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. My God, I love you. Jesus, you are so good. Let every war battle at your gate be won in favor, in your favor, in the mighty name of Jesus. Every war in, at your gate, let it be win. Every war, Every war battle at your gate be won in your favor. It will be win or be won with your favor, with the favor. Favor of God will fall upon you. And everywhere you step, everywhere you go, it will be open in the mighty name of Jesus. When the favor of God is in you, anything you touch, it will be gold. If you touch sand, it will turn gold. Anything you put your hand, it will prosper. Because the gates is open, nothing is holding. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, we thank God for you. I thank God for you. Your time has come to prosper in all that you do in the name of Jesus. Your time has come to prosper of all what you do in the mighty name of Jesus. It is your time to prosper. You have been in that stretch for a long time. You have been in broke. You have been suffering. You struggle with the finances. Your time has come to prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. The, the gates has been opened. The door has been opened. Receive it in the mighty name of Jesus. You have been struggling. Financial Pedro, you've been struggling all the time. You have been in debt, a lot of debt. You will prosper in the name of Jesus. It is your time. Hand must change. Power must change hand in the name of Jesus. It is time. It's your time. Those who are ahead of you, you will overcome them. You will overpower them. And you will prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. This is the month of prosperity. This is the month you are going to push and give good things. Nine, 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 nine months. The ninth month. That is a good, good things that is coming on your way in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, God. Thank you, Father. All the demonic harmonies waiting war at the gate of your life, I command them to be scattered in seven directions in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, all demonic armies waiting war at the gate of your life. Those demonic army waiting war at your gate. They don't want you to have anything. They come to your gate and make sure they have closed gates, they have closed doors for you. I command them to be scattered in seven ways. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the seven direction, by the way. Not seven direction. They would be scattered in the mighty name of Jesus. All those de de demonic hermes, demonic soldiers, demonic police women, demonic policemen, when they see something coming to you, they will come at your gate and close it. So you miss that. That's why you are, you, men of you, a, a, a brother was told, was telling me, that he got the opportunity to go to the television, national television. He prepared very well, prepared. And then some people, some wicked, evil Pentecostal witchcraft, when they heard that he is going to preach, because he was so happy, he announced, he announced. You know what? They fight, they fight, they fight until that man, is, uh, his opportunity was closed. You see, that is wickedness. If you know this prayer, you are praying this, no demon from the pit of hell will, will stop you, will close your door anymore. Your door is not going to be crossed by fire, by thunder, in the mighty name of Jesus. I am commanding them. I command them to scatter in seven directions in Jesus' name. All demonic, I pray all demonic armies waiting war at the gate of your life. At the gate of your, your opportunity, at the gate of your breakthrough, I command them to scatter in seven ways in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, all the assembles of Satan planning at your gate, I, I send conviction. When they are standing at the gate, I send conviction. Let conviction fall upon them in their camp in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I thank you, Jesus. My God, I give you the glory, God. Yes, my Father. I thank you very much, God. I thank you, Father, for this, God. You are wonderful. You are a good, God. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I bless your name. I thank you and I give you all the glory. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Thank you very much. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Isiki saying bye-bye to you. I want to prophesy to you. I want to pray with you one on one. If you are if you need me to prophesy, speak to your spirit so that the gates can be opened for you and, and the windows of heaven can open to you. Call me. I've given you my number. Our number is 647 647 608 5207. Uh, uh, our that that one you can text me, you can you can reach me. That is a cell phone. And our, our, our landline, 905-487-7196. You can call me for me to, 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 to minister to you one on one. Also, remember to donate to our ministry. If you are looking for our partners, if you are looking for a spiritual mother, you can, you can call me. In the name of Jesus, I'm here to help you, to, to, to pray with you. So go ahead and call me. After I finish this prayer, I will be sitting waiting for you, and I will I will take calls in the name of Jesus. Thank you very much. God bless you. God bless you once again. See you tomorrow morning, eight o'clock. I will continue with this with this message, part two of the of the message. Then Monday we'll be starting another topic. So remember, tomorrow will be spiritual opening gates. So we will talk about that. I have so much things that I want to, to put in your spirit. God bless you so much. See you tomorrow at 8 a.m. Invite your friends, invite your followers uh, and, and your family. Let them come and benefit. I will be praying for those people who are sick, people who have, who have been blocked, who have been, who have been uh, uh, struggling with the finances. I will pray for you and God will help you. Go to our website www.overcomers dh ministry.blogspot.ca and plant a seed if you don't know how to do it call me i will help you there's so many ways you can send your seed you can send through western union through manegram through uh, money order you can send our peer box we have the peer box we can give you the the the, 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 the address you can send your your donation so you it depends an amount we don't, God does not ask you anything you don't have. Always God asks you what you have. If you are, you can support us, we are supporting children in Africa, orphanage. I need to have a, a, a computer. I don't have a, a laptop. I need a laptop. If you can support us to get this a laptop, God will help you. I bad. So I want to pray that God will bless you. That's how God will open gates and doors from heaven. Go and plant a seed. This ministry is a good soil. If you plant our ministry, you will receive the blessings of God. I will take your seed to the, to, the, to the altar and I will pray for you. I will pray and I pray until I see money coming to your hand. Those people are following me. They can testify. They can give you a testimony. Thank you very much. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. Bye-bye. Bye.